Hello, so you are watching a tutorial on multicam editing. Um, so to begin with, we're going to import all of our footage into the bin. You can go to file, go to file, import, and then I'm going to import these two files here, and then we're going to import them into the bin. Um, and if they're not highlighted, you can just go ahead and highlight both by clicking shift to highlight both of them. And then do control click or right click um, and go down to create multi-camera source sequence. And now once you're in this area, we're just going to set our sequence. So you can go ahead and name your sequence here. I'm going to leave mine as conversation one. Um, you want to make sure the sequence presets are at automatic. That helps with audio. And when you go in, if the audio isn't linked up, then you'll have to readjust your clip so that your audio from both clips or the multiple clips line up. Um, and then you want to make sure the box for move source clips to a process clip bin is checked. And then after you have all that situated, you can go ahead and press OK. Um, and then it appeared right over here. And all your clips here are together. Um, and now what we can do is create another sequence. And I do Command N. Or you can go up into file and then new sequence. Um, we're going to say editing track. And we'll press OK. And then voila, here goes our new sequence. And you want to make sure this is highlighted and checked as blue. Um, it helps with the nesting of your files. And you want to drag your nested file over, which is the one with the double bars that are lined up. I'm going to put this here. I'm going to keep sis existing settings for right now. Um, once we're in here, as you can see, mine are lined up already. Um, and I hear both tracks. Perfect. Audio is synced. Um, and then you want to go in up here in the top right hand side of your view. And you want to click on the tool. And once you click on the tool, you want to change your view multi-camera and this allows you to see both angles simultaneously and then as you continue this would be helpful because it allows you to basically cut your video while looking at both screens um, so let's say we're gonna start rolling at the beginning um, and then you want to switch to a different camera and you keep going obtaining certification at St. Paul Neighborhood Network. And as you're going and you find pieces that you want to cut between, you just go ahead and toggle back and forth between the sequences, uh, I mean, sorry, between the files that you see, and you go back and forth and back and forth. And then once you stop, as you see here at the bottom, it has spliced your sequence for you. And when you go in, you can see how it, go, how it jumps back and forth from one to the other based off of the two that you chose at the top when you went back and forth. Um, and, then you, and then you continue that throughout your entire video. And then once you are done at the end, you can go back and see which pieces um, worked. And if not, you can always start over and toggle back and forth until you cut it perfectly the way you want it. Um, and this works with mul multiple camera angles. We just have two here, but you can have more than two. Um, yeah, hope you enjoyed the tutorial.